Hey everybody, how you doing? Welcome back to another reaction video. Today we have episode 6 and 7 of One Piece. In the last couple episodes, we got to meet Shanks and Buggy D Clown. If you didn't see that reaction, definitely go check it out because it's an important introduction for two very important characters. So you definitely need to see that. But if you have seen it, uh, let's get on into episode 6. Desperate situation. Beast Tamer Moji. I said that name right. Moji. Emoji. Like emoji? No, don't say that. That's stupid. Don't be stupid. Don't be an idiot. That's from the office. That quote changed my life. Cause they're not bad people, Nami. They're all good people. All these like the, Not all pirates are good people. I won't say that now. Look at Buggy. He's not a good person whatsoever. <laughs> But Shanks, Shanks is a great guy. Shanks is a good guy. I like how they still show he he, he got stabbed. He's he's not he's hurting. Like I said, they they really like nerf Zoro for a lot of these fights. Because if they didn't nerf Zoro, then he would have just been able to take out everybody like by himself. I guess like you never realize it at first. Especially with Don Krieg. Oh my god, especially with Don Krieg. Buggy, he got nerfed for. Is he still hurt in the fight after this on Usopp's Island on Surf Village? I don't know, I think he's still hurt. Like, Zoro's just hurt through all these East Blue fights. <laughs> I love this dog. This dog is goaded. Shout out to my doggie. She's over there. She got the key the whole time? Or did she steal it? No, she's, she stole it. She's good at stealing. Forgot about that. Liar. You're just a good person, too. <laughs> oh my god, he ate it? I did forgot about that. Oh my god, I haven't watched this in a while. <laughs> Stupid dog. Oh my god. I love this early East Blue One Piece because, like, th this is the dilemma. It's not that the enemy's strong or anything. It, the dilemma is Luffy's stuck in a cage and the dog ate the key. We said that already, my guy. We said that a bunch of times. <laughs> he said, I'm out. Let me sleep it off. I'm fine. I'll be good in the morning. What? Man. They had a person voice that dog. They could have got a, a dog to yawn. Dogs have a very st distinct yawn. That was not a dog's yawn. That was a person's yawn. That's so funny. Guarding the shot. It's not because of the food, though. Even the dog has a bad, like a like a sad backstory, man. It's crazy how Oda has like does it in this story. Even the dog has a sad backstory. The memes are all true. And somehow the dog is still sadder than most of the other wolf ones. <laughs> shoo shoo. Goated dog. Man's best friend for real. Look at him. Again with the yawn. Get a real dog, please, next time. Oh god. I love the still frames. <laughs> no, I really like the uh, the backgrounds and how they're kind of whited out. Man, the style of this is just like I know most shows do this, but like look at the look at the edges of the sh of the show. Something's coming. The dog really ate the key on him. <laughs> 
Can you believe it? Moji is actually one of the strongest characters in the show. Next to Buggy, Moji's probably top... I, I won't give him top 5, but Moji's probably top 10 in the verse. He does have a weird, like... He does have a weird uh, character design, though. He's got the ears, and then he's got the, 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 the mutton chops into the beard. It just goes all the way around. Oda just made him, like... Richie! Oh, I love Richie. Richie's goaded, for real. Kind of funny how Luffy recruited, like, the most, like, well, no, I guess, like, one of the most famous people in the East Blue. I guess, uh, technically, um, I guess Don Creek is more famous than Zoro. Don Krieg's got a crazy bounty. Well, Zoro doesn't have a bounty because he's a bounty hunter. He's not a pirate. He technically works for the or with the Marines. So I don't know. Once they found out he was a pirate, I feel like Zoro had all this like um like infamy. Like everybody knew his name in the East Blue. How come he didn't get a bounty right away? Like they knew he teamed up with Luffy as soon as Luffy got his bounty. They should have dropped one for him right away, too. I mean, I, get, I know it's, like, a part of the story, and, like, you know, you gotta drop Luffy's, and then you drop both of them, and then, you know, you give everyone else one. But, like, they, like, honestly, like, if the Marines were actually doing what they were supposed to, they should have given Zoro a bounty at the beginning, too. They should have given Zoro a, Zoro a bounty as soon as he defeated Morgan. Zoro should have got the first bounty before Luffy. Well, I guess the Marines never reported Luffy because they wanted to like, give him like a. They didn't want the Marines to be on him. This is what I mean. They give the dog a sad backstory. Oh my god. One last one. Cry. Can I, can I make myself cry? Let me see. Let me try. The dog's so cute as a little baby. Shoo shoo! Does that mean something in Japanese? What does it mean in Japanese? Probably nothing, but if it does, put it up here. Don't eat the merchandise. Dude, I, I like I love my dog and everything, but I would not share a piece of meat with my dog. My dog licks its like ass and stuff. Like I'm not dealing with that on my food. You still come at us. Shut up. Emoji. I was gonna call you Richie, but Richie's the dog the the, the lion. Why well, you got a lot of my dog, man? Guard the shot till I get back. You literally cursed him. You cursed my guy. My dog. Why am I calling this dog a guy? Those footprints, like, from the burning ashes of it on his paws are, like, blood. I don't know which one's worse. Jesus. I forget how brutal this early One Piece is. I wonder how the voice actor got, like, I wonder if, like, the voice actor applied because, like, they saw a position, like, bark, can bark like a dog. Or if it was just, like, someone in-house that they had, they were like, yeah, you kind of sound like a dog, we'll let you do it. I wonder if, I wonder how they found that, that voice actor. Oh, Luffy knows about mementos, he's got his, uh, straw hat, baby. I don't even care about Moji. Every time I see Richie, I'm just gonna call him out. Screw Moji, but Richie! We love Richie here. Richie's goaded. Richie, look at Richie. Richie's got a snack and everything. The only reason we mess with Moji is because Richie messes with Moji slightly. And even then, I don't even know if Richie messes with Moji that much. Richie! Richie, I'm sorry, we gotta get pieced up, but that's okay. We still love you, Richie. Just because you can't do nothing doesn't mean we don't love you. <laughs> no! Aw, oh, Richie, it's sad to see you go out like this, but... Nothing you can do about it. I'm a rubber man. Damn. Oh my god, he just... Come here! Oh my god, that's exactly what he did. 
So we didn't have a knife, he just punched him. That would have been crazy if he just stabbed him. Yeah. Why? Why do you assume that? Oh, I forgot, because Arlong. I was like, why did you just assume I'm a bad person? Watch this. Watch this, not me. Watch what my boy does for my dog right here. Oh, look at this. Pet food. Oh my god, look at this moment. Look at this moment. Oh my god. Yeah, he did. 100%. 100%. Cuz that's the type of person he is. Shout out to Luffy. Look at him. You did fight good. Mhm. Mm Shout out Luffy. See, like this is how you can kind of tell that like Garb raised a marine, but like he became a pirate for different reasons. But Garp raised, like, a good person. The Mountain Bandits raised a good person. Oh my god, what's her name? I'm blanking on her name. Oh my god, who is the girl Mountain Bandit? No, how can I forget her name? I'm not gonna remember. Put it up there in the corner. Please. Quick shout out to her. Yeah. He beat Richie somehow, which is like semi impossible because Richie's the second. Richie's stronger than Moji. And I said Moji was top 10, Richie's top 5. Mugiwara. The special buggy balls. Oh my god. Damn, he's gonna blow the entire town up. How scum. Yeah, you did. You literally meant to yell at him. Luffy don't care though. Luffy's 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 been through worse, you know. The youngin is dead. Nah, Zoro's fine. <laughs> What's up with these like um like golden drawings of them that they're doing right now? That's right, that's true. And somehow the dog is still stronger than you. Sochi. <laughs> Buggy the clown. Me too. You won't let him die. Why not? Whatever happened to Zoro's little hat that he had? His little scarf that, or his little like, place he put it around his arm. Whatever happened to that? Why doesn't he use it anymore? I want to see him put it on. <laughs> I'll never be a pirate. Oh god, no, he's here by himself. That's no good. Boodle! Weird name. No, treasure can be whatever someone believes it to be, Buggy. The thing about Buggy, like, I understand he has this mindset, but he knows that people, like, think that way. He knew Whitebeard. Why did his eyes change? I feel like his eyes were a different color. Like, above his eyes? Why was it black there? But like, no, like, Buggy knows people- it's blue now. They just- they just mess it up. But like, Buggy knows people have dreams. Like, Whitebeard had a different dream. Roger's dream wasn't about gold. Did Buggy know Roger's real dream? 
we still don't know what Raj's real dream is, and supposedly it's probably... Not supposedly, we just like... It probably is Luffy's dream. Heck yeah. Ah, to be continued. Alright, so that was episode 6 of One Piece. Uh, R.I.P. Richie, he had to get beat, you know, Luffy's a little bit too strong for him right now, but we know that Richie, and later in the story, gets really strong, he's obviously top 5 characters in One Piece, so it's okay. Richie had to get beat right now, but he does get stronger later on, we know that. Uh, let's get into episode 7, this one's called Epic Showdown, Swordsman Zoro vs. Acrobat Kabiji. Kabaji. I don't know how to say his name, but he's whack. Let's get into this. Alright, we already saw that. We already saw the intro for this, okay? We already saw the intro for. We don't need to see it again. Why do we need to see the intro again? We don't. Epic Showdown. Swordsman Zoro versus Acrobat. How do you say it? Kabaji! I didn't say it right either time. Oh my god. Mugiwara! It's a cooler nickname than it is in English. In Japanese. Well, it probably doesn't sound as cool in Japanese, but it, like, it sounds cool in English. Mugiwara. I guess you can see anything could sound cool if you say it in that voice. Tomato juice. That would probably sound cool in like Japanese if they don't speak English. Oh my god, he just knocks him out for no reason. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, why did you attack the mayor? He was in the way, that's true, he was. <laughs> That's true. You could have, like, tied him up or something. You could have, like, tried to conversate with him. No, but this is the fastest way. It's fine. Oh, that's how you're gonna get him. You're just gonna call him out right away. <laughs> Buggy ball. <laughs> it's the first time he used balloon. He uses that a lot. I love that attack. I think this is the first time he used the balloon. Look at Naomi. Yeah, that was a dud. They would all be dead if that was a regular buggy ball. What the hell? What was that? He did fight the lion. Oh, she still doesn't know he has a devil fruit? Yeah, what is that? Oh my god. Oh my god, he used his menace as shield? Uh, damn, what a menace. Where's Richie? Please tell me Richie's okay. Where's Richie? <laughs> Rubber. They did it again. Why do they make his eyes black and not blue? Now they're blue. Oh, that explains it. Buggy's not surprised by double fruits. Not only does he have one, he's seen them all. He's seen them all. No! Okay, we hate Kabaji. Oh my god, he used Richie as a shield? How the Asshole, how dare you use Richie as a shield? Yeah, 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 mess him up. It's okay, Zoro messes him up for us. Yeah, mess up Moji too. We don't like Moji. We like Richie though. Shout out Richie. I'm so upset he just got hurt. 
Show them your acrobat show. Yeah, okay, pal. Yeah, okay, pal. Look at him. Acrobat show. Look at him. He's on a unicycle, clown. Oh, I guess he is in the clown pirates. Makes sense, I guess. A clown. One sword? I'd say no. Oh, two. I was gonna say, I'd say you know he's not serious. He's only using one. Yeah, you should probably rest. Murder at the steam bath. Oh, that's a cool attack. Damn. This guy's actually comp for Zoro at this point. Well, no, he got stabbed. I forgot. He literally got stabbed. He's, he's hurt. This guy's not comp for Zoro. <laughs> Look at his face. Oh my god, he's got the like dead fish eyes. Roro Noro Zoro. He's not defeated yet, so I don't know what you're talking about. Just got stabbed. He's fine. He dodged it. Oh wait, he actually let him stab him? What? Why did you let him do that? That was the. Why did you let him do that? I forgot. Like I, I like I totally forgot about that. I guess. Why did you just let him stab you? What? Stupidest thing I've ever heard. You could be strong as hell, but why are you being stupid and letting him just stab you like that? What the hell? That's true. Zoro's going to be the best, so he has to beat you at least. <laughs> Nami's a pacifist. She just steals from pirates because she thinks they're bad people. Smart. She did say let's meet up again, so like I guess that means she wants to be a part of the crew at least at some point, huh? She said let's meet up again. How does she know the treasure's down there? How does she know that? That's the question. The drunk guys. Just chilling. And the chart. Do they ever, like, do they even ever use the charts? They talk so much about these charts, but do they ever even use them? Damn, he's screwed. He's about to get got. Oh, Luffy saved him. And he's just nice like that, he dodged it. I forget, Bucky can feel pain. Yeah. Oh, I thought they were gonna show Nami. They played Nami song. Ow! Just hurt myself. Oh my god, how the hell did Bucky get all that gold? What? Man, I have really not watched One Piece like this all the way through in a while. I did not realize Buggy had that much gold. This is like a really interesting thing you can go to back and watch all the way through. Because whenever I rewatch One Piece, I really do just have it on to the background and I'm just listening to the dub. I've already seen it enough to be like, okay. As long as I know what they're talking about, I know what's going on. I just like to listen to them talk. Gotcha. Heading da. Ooh. She's got the coke key. No, you can't. He just you got stabbed, dude. Shut up with your f like 
You're talking all this smack like you can do something to Zoro, the great Zoro, but you literally can't. He gets stabbed. Yeah, yeah, for, like, if I stabbed you, you wouldn't even be able to get up, my guy. You'd be on the ground calling for Richie. Who you use as a shield, by the way. Screw you for that. And he's got, like, the worst hairstyle ever. Barber screwed his shit up like crazy. Oh, my God. Gotta get a new barber, my guy. Look at Zoro. Ooh, first time we see Onigiri. Gotcha. Is this the first time we see Onigiri? I think so. Got him. Yeah, you get stabbed, you're not getting back up, my guy. Look at you. You got stabbed, you're not getting back up. Yeah, that's right. Look at you. Get him, Luffy. Get him. You guys are pirates? Yeah, I've sold I've sailed the boat. I've sailed the Grand Line. I think we find out he knows Shanks like here. <laughs> yes, sir. That would make me God, then you are God. You are buggy God. Yeah, we do find out about that. Red hair. Yeah. Shanks. Uh, kind of funny. The, where was so we know where Shanks was born. I don't want to say that because that was revealed in um film Red. But where was Buggy born? Do we know that? How did they both end up in the East Blue? <laughs> Did they come here together? Oh! Roger's execution. Stupid idiot. Put two and two together. Execution in the East Blue. Bucky goes to execution. Shanks goes to execution. Both of them in the East Blue. Makes sense. Ooh, he's got that good future sight. Look at that. Buggy's, like, for real got future sight right there. You saw the way he dodged that? Watch this. Yep, called that. See that future sight he's got? Man, Buggy for real is top ten char- like, top three characters in One Piece. Like, strong-wise. Like, like, strength-wise. Nice save. Oh, he still got you. So like, do they just pick and choose? Oh, I guess he has he has hockey. Uh, Buggy obviously has hockey at this point. I was gonna say because Luffy in the first episode was able to break swords when he got punched or when he got stabbed, but here he gets stab he gets stabbed by knives and he actually gets cut. But I guess it makes sense. Buggy obviously has hockey, and it's obviously advanced conqueror's hockey. Obviously, it's Buggy. You know what that hat is, Buggy. You know, you've seen that hat since you were a kid. What are you talking about? Like, if anything, I feel like you wouldn't want to disrespect that hat because you know who had it originally. Like, wasn't Roger your guy? I feel like you were close to Roger like that. Maybe not. I don't know nothing about him. Ooh. That's true, protect it better. Damn. Bye bye hat. I'm pretty sure um they keep up with the uh the the hole marks in the hat. I'm pretty sure it gets stitched with something, but you can still like faintly see the hole marks in the hat. You know what that hat is, bro. I wonder, did but um did Oda have a plan where Buggy and Shanks were gonna be on Roger's crew, or at least that that Shank that Buggy was gonna be? Oh, here we go. Oh, I guess he got that as a kid, so he never saw Roger have it. Oh, 
So, okay, I guess he got it as a kid, and then Buggy always saw Shanks with it on, so I guess he would disrespect it, because he doesn't like Shanks. But I thought if he if he, if he he knew it was Roger's hat originally, I don't know if he'd be disrespectful like that. So I wonder how early on Shanks got that hat. Probably early. He just hit him where the sun don't shine? That's crazy. Damn. Yeah, he can't say whatever he wants about Shanks. He has that right. Buggy earned that privilege. Do we get that flashback in this episode? That'd be cool. I don't think so, though. The one person. Dang. Shout out to Shanks. No. We rock a buggy to be continued. Dang. Alright, so that was episode 7 of One Piece. We got to see uh, Zoro fight Kobaji. Uh, Kobaji. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it right that time. And we got to see Luffy fight Buggy, the beginning of the fight. And I think the next episode is going to be the end of the fight. This the, the Orange Village arc is going by faster than I thought it would. I thought the... Uh, I thought the orange village arc was a lot longer, but I guess this one goes pretty quick. And the Serb village arc is a little longer, but that I was looking at the like the episode list and how they go. That one's a lot quicker than I remember too. It might like feel longer because the episodes are gonna come out like uh two uh, two per day, maybe two per like every other day. But like the episodes are going pretty quick. Like they look like I'm gonna be able to get through the East Blue Blue pretty fast. So um yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, uh, leave a comment on your favorite part of the video. Uh, shout out to Buggy D Clown and to uh, Richie, the two strongest characters of One Piece back to back. Uh, if you could leave a like and subscribe if you like the video and uh, you want to see any future content. And if you want to see the full unedited version of uh, the this video and any other future videos, please check out my Patreon. I'm going to upload them all on there, unedited, no cuts, no anything. You can watch the full thing. Uh, I think it's three dollars a month right now. I may lose or lower or raise it depending on how many people subscribe But for right now, it's three dollars a month So please go uh, subscribe to that if you want to see the full thing If not, you can just watch the full video on YouTube edited because I have to be able to upload it If I don't edit it, I can't upload it So I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much